As it goes with most things that doctors and or experts or the mainstream tells you, you have to do the opposite to find truth. In this case, when doctors and experts say that you're getting too much sun, it really means you're getting too little sun. When I diagnose a basal cell skin cancer in a patient, the first thing I say is congratulations because you're walking out of my office with a lot longer life expectancy than when you walked in. And the only sane dermatologist in the world, Dr. Richard Wheeler. You may have seen this guy, Brian Johnson, Generally, I like his stuff and his message, and I like the idea of living a long time and optimizing whatever, but he gets a few things wrong, and that's to be understood. But he's a perfect example of somebody that reads a lot of quote-unquote research and comes to the wrong conclusions. In this example, he has a video where he literally says, don't get morning sunlight. When morning sunlight is the single most effective thing, like perhaps the most effective thing that you could do for your health is getting morning sunlight into your eyes and onto your skin. And look, he looks like a vampire as a result because he's read a lot of really bad research that basically created and funded the entire sunscreen industry to have you perpetually afraid of the sun. So eat a plant-based diet, which is another example of really bad research, meta-analysis and other crap like that, a big, a big circle jerk of researchers and scientists funded by big food and big pharma that have come together and they study each other's papers. And they put out a bunch of garbage, not actually randomly controlled experiments or anything, mind you. And they say, there's correlations between eating this and eating that and eat all complete bullshit. Which is why those of us that eat an animal-based diet wisely, based on the diet that our ancestors ate, we're freaking thriving. When you see the experts or the mainstream tell you to do something, and it's very commonly accepted by most of them, that's a literal heuristic, a sign that you should do the opposite. 